Hello Taurus and welcome to your coffee cup reading for the week ahead of September 16th through the 22nd. I want to mention again, I did change my email about two months ago and I do have people still trying to email me on my other email, which I do not get sometimes because the storage is overdone um, and I'm going to be eliminating it. So please do not email me on my old email. The new email is listed below this video. Okay, um, I got over bronchitis and now I'm sniffling again. It's like I'm catching another cold. This is just insane. So I'm sorry. <laughs> okay, so let's see what's happening. Taurus. Hmm. You've got some obstacles to get through. Okay, um, you definitely need to balance your yin and yang. Okay. Um, know to combine when to be emotional, uh, intuitive, logical, you know, the yin and yang needs to be applied this week, okay? I do see some of you may be dealing with contracts. You have spade coming through here and you do have it here too. This could be contracts, legalities, agreements, things like that, but you do need to have a plan and a backup plan and strategy, a very good strategy. It's really coming through very strongly. I also see some of you, um, there is a focus on money, growth, business, very business oriented. Maybe, maybe these are good business deals too. Some of you may be dealing with um, finances. Um, a lot of that is coming through. Home foundation, there is a focus here and making some kind of adjustments. It looks good. Um, do trust your intuition. You do have very supportive energy as well. Now, there can be a turn of events this week, which can create some anxiety. Okay, so I do see that. It's uh, karmic too. So the energy is turning. This could be something karmic happening as well. And a turn of events for some of you. I do see worry, stress. Um, so kind of be careful. This also your health and well-being. Um, get your rest, get your sleep if you need, okay? I do see a lot of that energy coming through too. I do see a new financial beginning. Something is happening here too. I do see also an emotional new beginning coming through too. Now, you have new beginnings. New beginnings are not the easiest, okay? It's the beginning of things. So um, we are seeing this energy. This can also indicate um, the fruition of something new. This could indicate uh, pregnancy. This can indicate, you know, if you've been, if you planning to get pregnant um, or the birth of something new. So there, there is new beginnings there too. I can look at that too because we see a lot of that energy here as well. I do see some of you dealing with domineering people. This could be dealing with people in authority and also taking more control in your life. Okay. You do have a lot of strength this week. It's like you're the warrior and I'm seeing that on the plate. It's like you're the warrior, but there are certain things that you're going to have to walk away from. Um, certain things that you're going to have to let go, okay? There is some sense of attachment to things, things that no longer serve you. It's like holding tightly to some kind of energy, but letting go, and then you're going to be able to clear your path somehow. So it's not the easiest, but it does show up like that. I'm seeing more also a boost of energy and confidence this week that's going to make you open up about your desires and your emotional side too. Um, I do see also... Um, you could be a lot more assertive this week, more self-assured. Um, so make a point to open up your significant needs and desires this week too. But again, do it assertively, not aggressively, okay? I see direct communication can be followed up by a little bit of provoking type of action. I think that's the best way to explain that, okay? Um, I do see money coming through here too. There's a focus on it um, or money that's, you know, cash flow income, money that you earn. Um, I do see very creative energy coming through as well. Communication is going to be very important. Also, how you manage your daily time, your, your, your everyday needs, your everyday schedule, your routines is really showing up. There's a focus on it, okay? You need to make some kind of unique um, approach to it. Uh, change a little bit, some things up. Um, something could be, uh, there could be an offering coming in, a unique opportunity, connect with um, others too. Um, these could be colleagues at work, people that you work with, people that you associate with. Brainstorming is coming through. Like I said, strategizing, having a plan is coming through. 
um, projects that could lead to new stream of cash, okay? It could be connected to money as well. So, you know, we've got this tree of growth here too. So there's a lot of changes still going on. Something significantly rushing in, going out, can be very fast um, ongoing energy as well, okay? There is a heart in the spiritual area, so connect spiritually as well. Now, on the plate, something significant. It's almost, it's forming like a spade, but then there's no end to it. So there is something that is forming that's going to be long term. Now, uh, just know that what I'm seeing here is disappointing news, maybe a lack of enthusiasm. It's supposed to be like a new idea, but then again, it's like maybe a dealings with some setbacks, delays. You may be even changing your mind. Again, there are some things that you need to let go of, either whether it's fear, the old ways of doing things, attached or holding on to energy too tightly. There is something that you need to make a choice um, and let go of, just give it to the universe. What be, what will be, will be, is the energy I'm seeing here. Again, you have um, extreme strength here too. You're definitely the warrior. Um, spiritual strength too is on your side here. Um, needing to be prepared. There's a sense of making some kind of self-sacrifice too. Um, you need to spiritually uh, discipline yourself too. So give things to the universe. We can't control everything, okay? This is also achieving some kind of victory, but with honor, okay? Righteous success, all right? Trying to support noble causes. There is challenges to overcome, delays, things like that. Self-discipline, honor is very important. You need to sharpen your mind, body, and your power too, and your spiritual uh, spiritual power too, and balance that yin and yang, as I was saying as well, okay? Well, um, Taurus, that was your messages for the week of September 16th through the 22nd. I hope you have a wonderful week and I'll catch you back next week for your next coffee cup reading. Until then, all the best and bye for now.